Hello and welcome to my video and I apologize for any noise in this video it is chilling down with rain and I'm sure it's going to be coming through on the video but uh, yeah let's have a look at the cards what I can hear is pitter patter pitter patter on the windows and well <laughs> let's get into the cards let's ignore the horrible weather out there and hope we get some sunshine on these cards it is round two of the last card standing ignore these two. and the four cards that made it through were bingo super sevens Five years for you and uh, Blazing Seven. What an odd mix of cards, eh? These two 500 loaded I've only added because it feels a bit weird doing three, six, seven, eight, nine pound cards. So 19 pound, that's sort of bumps it up a bit, doesn't it? And weirdly, really completely out of context, when I brought these two cards from the post station, the lady singled this card out and we weren't even talking about the cards. She just literally just suddenly went, that one's a winner. And gave me a really weird look. So uh, I hope she's a witch and uh, she just predicted a winning card. We'll find out after we do the round two cards. So basically, if you picked any of these cards, congratulations if it's the winner. And uh, if you're thinking about entering, it's too late because all entries are now closed. So let's see which card is the last card standing. I'm, I'm hoping they all win and we get a round three. But here we go. Round two of last card standing. Yeah, I bet you won't see her combination of these cards in any videos this week on the on youtube here we go blazing sevens is it going to be a winner will it go out in a blaze of glory will it be a fizzle and a damp squid four pound no 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 so no three of a kind in any direction so unless they're all duds it's eliminated right five years for you good luck if you pick this card lounger and a plane we really wish my darling was with me because she was in the live scratching these with me and it would be nice to do in round two with her but she's up in hull up in sunny hull so flip-flops passport sunshine and a phone a fan a camera bikini and some shorts that one's eliminated as well so sorry if you picked five years for you i'm hoping one of them will have a win on it super sevens won't let me down here we go. Good luck if you pick this. 8 and 41. Not many did. I think most people went for um, five years for you, the £2 card. 8 and 41. Well, I can't say I blame them. £2 cards have been on fire. 9 and 40. Twenty-two and twenty-seven. Why well, has it gone quiet? The rain stopped. Thirty-one forty-nine, and it started up again. <laughs> Thirty-one forty-nine. It's a kiss of death, isn't it? When you say, "Oh, the rain stopped." Thirty-one forty-nine. Twenty thirty-six. Worst thing is if you say, at least it ain't thunder and lightning. Boom. That's the cue for it to start. 26. 25. 28. 29 would be nice. 28. 29. There we go. 3 and 45. 33 and 53. I had a really squint there. 33. Three. 32 and 34. Well, that's pants. Let me double check though. Is there a seven? Nope. Is there a 29? Nope. 37? Nope. 35? Nope. 46? Got to double check because 
Whereas if I miss a win on the other videos, it's just embarrassing. On this, it actually affects the outcome, doesn't it? All right, bingo. Are we going to win on bingo? Here we go. 25-44. I never would have picked bingo as the winner of Last Card Standing. He's got a chance. He watches sales of bingo go through the roof. He's got a £100 winner on this. 25-44. Thirteen forty seven, my lucky number. It's got to be a good omen. Oh, I never said this at the beginning. Good luck if you picked bingo. There were a few of you. Forty three fifty eight. Sometimes wonder if people pick the card they think is going to win, or they just pick the card that they like. Because cards like this don't know didn't get many votes so I wonder if it's just bingo lovers that pick this 7 and 55 9 and 53 37 would be nice 10 pound win 21, 51. Oh, one away. I'm six quid. 21, 51. 27, 64. 3 and 17. Thirty two fifty six Oh dear Oh dear Number fifteen Oh dear oh dear And no fingers either they're all duds Now the question I get asked a lot is what happens if they're all duds? Well if you watch enough of my last card standing videos you'll know that I always have a backup pair. <laughs> So every card is back in. So if you was like disappointed when you saw Blazing Sevens lose at the start, well, fingers crossed again because we're doing a do-over. So can I get a quid? Whoa! We got a winner. I don't think you can get anything else, but you know you got to go through the motions and scratch it all off. But we got a pound. We got a winner. Hooray! Right, good luck to everybody who picked five years for you. Camera and a fan is what we're after. We got a plane and we got sunshine. We got a bottle. Bikini. We got a lounger, a lime, a phone, and flip flops. Sadly, even with a do over, it's eliminated. Right. Didn't really need those two. 500 loaded still. I ended up with 18 pound. If you include all the last card standing cards being doubled, it's going just slightly more. There we go. Right, 21. Twenty-one fifty-one. Oh, there we are. I kept double checking at the top because I thought I must have missed them. 11 and 43. 43. There's 11. 1 and 4. Twenty seven and forty five. Uh, thirty two fifty five. Eight 
8 and 35. Oh, just need 47. 47. 48. Nearly. 10 and 48. Um, 26 and 40. And eighteen twenty. All right, so no nine and no sixteen. No forty seven. No number twelve. That's a dud. Blazing sevens. If this is a dud, blazing sevens will want it. All right, here we go. So 36 and 65. This is exciting, isn't it? If you pick blazing sevens, you'll be hoping that this is a dud. Whereas if you pick this as your last card standing, you'll be hoping that it has a last ditch win on it. 36, 65. Forty seven and fifty seven. Nine and twenty four. And number sixteen at the top there. Five and twenty two. Eight and seventeen. Six and twenty eight. Last line. Are we going to get our winner? Blazing sevens. 37, 55. We got a win. We just got a row for five pounds. I'm just going to double check that. So we just scratched off 37 and 55. 65, yeah, that was there. And five and 17. There's 17, there's five, yeah, we got, oh no, we're going to have to have another video because I haven't got any more Blazing Sevens on Bingo, so what I'll do is I'll have a round three, I was hoping for a round three, but there's a part of me that's like, oh god, 461, <coughs> I do apologise, the Blazing Sevens are not easy cards to find anymore, I should have brought more than just two 461, although I do know a shop that sells them, let's just hope they still got them. If you're wondering why I'm still going, it's because you can get more than one win. Like that. We just got another win. 15 and 42. We just got a column for another fiver. 15 and 42. 15 and 42. How cool is that? 15, 42. So a row there and a column there. Five and five. Ten pounds. And number 12. Which gives us nothing. Go on, give me a tenner up here as well. That'd be funny. Now we have eggs. We've got a tenner there. Nice. So um, I will have to do another follow-up video, I'm afraid. But Bingo and Blazing Sevens are into round three. Huzzah. And uh, nice win. £10 win on Bingo. Bingo seems to be paying out now. Um, and a quid, obviously, on Blazing Sevens. So congratulations if you picked Blazing Sevens and Bingo. You are in round three. And commiserations if you pick Super 7s and 5 years for you. There will be another competition coming up. So um, you can enter. And it is free to enter. You don't have to be a member. You don't have to give me money. There's no like buying raffle tickets or sending me PayPal amounts of money. I just ask that you subscribe. That's all I do.
and subscribing is 100% completely free. Um, so look out for round three. Hopefully, I'll get it up tomorrow. Anyway, we still got those two 500 loaders, and let's see if the um, fortune telling um, petrol station attendant is correct with card number 37. Let's have a look. Let's see how those 500 loaders do. So we'll start with 36, and then we'll do her card. Here we go. All the way down to row six. And I looked, I specifically looked at the number. So it wasn't this one she tapped, it was the other one. And it was really weird, it's really out of context. 39, 34, 19, 22, 37, 27, you know what we're looking for. A match. 42 and 7, 2 and 39, although double pound symbol. 17, 26, which seems to be rarer than rocking horse poo. You just don't see it, do you? Number nine. 28, 18, 3, 11 and 18, 14, 33, 28, 32, 24, 23. Weirdly, I just want to get onto the other card. I've got a feeling this will be a dud and the other one will be a winner. It sent chills up my spine when she did it. It was a weird look she gave me. 35, 36, 8 and 14, 21, 25, 16, 41, 34, 12. Well, that'll probably be a dud. I was getting the opes up. I need to have them dashed. 29, 8, 31, 35, 33, 36, 6 and 9, 38, and 1. I was like, do you know what? I knew in my heart that that was a dud. £500 loaded. It is a £500 winner. I'm definitely going back. It was scraped there, but I don't think that would have seen a win, would it? No, of course not. Um... I saw a pull-out machine anyway. Right, reading too much into it. It's just a random woman. 1 and 8. 41, 38. She was right! Hooray! <laughs> she literally went, that's a winner. It gave me such a weird look. 38, so 2 and 2. 38, 24. 1, 35, 29, 26. Can we get any more? Well, that palaver, and it turns out to be a five pound win as well. <laughs> 25, 36, 9, 37, 8, 11, 7, 33, 16, 19. There's the offset. Usually, is tell that it's going to be a winner. 19 and 1. Six, seventeen, twenty-two, thirty-four, thirty-one, twenty-seven, thirty-six, thirty-seven. 28, 22. 12, 25, 39, 17, 21, 13, 32 and 3, 18 and 7. So it was the two twos for a pound. Nothing spectacular, but isn't that weird? Fortune telling petrol attendant. <laughs> anyway. Um, I forgot how much was in the video. I think there was 10 of these, or £10 of these. £18 of those, that's 28 I got 15 18 uh, 15 16 so £12 down. I, mean, I don't know, you can do the maths. You can do the maths. But it was it was a fun video, and I had a little bit of fun doing that. Uh, it was a lovely mix. Not cards I normally would have done in a video together. So, uh, yeah, huzzah for that. Look out for round three. It will be coming up soon. So there'll be some Blazing Sevens and some Dual Bingos. And uh, we'll finally find out who will be the last card standing. Look after yourself and those you love. And I'll see you again real soon. Bye, all.